parable of the lost sheep. Luke 15, 3 to 7. Luke chapter 15. So he told them this parable. Which of you with a hundred sheep, if he lost one, would not leave the 99 in the desert and go after the missing one till he finds it? So you're taking sheep out. Well, we don't really have sheep and desert and this day and age. But you lose one. How you how you are aware that you lose one? You are constantly monitoring them. So you had a hundred, a hundred, all of a sudden you miss one, you know exactly where to go, where to find them. And you have confidence in the other 99 that you would leave them in the desert. Unprotected. And to suffer a little bit because if you're in the desert, you know, the breeze, the wind, the heat, the dust, lack of water. But you're willing to make that sacrifice for one sheep. Jesus came on the face of the earth and made the great sacrifice so that we could inherit eternal life. We too, as believers, need to make not only one sacrifice, but many sacrifices so that others can have eternal life. Which of you with a hundred sheep, you lose one, you wouldn't leave the 99 in the desert and go and look and find it. And when he found it, he would joyfully take it up in his shoulders. And when he got home, he would call together his friends and neighbors, rejoice with me for I have found my sheep that was lost. In that way, there will be great rejoicing in heaven over one sinner rather than 99 who have no need of repentance. So it teaches us how we need to be tolerant, patient with others so that all of us can inherit eternal life. Tomorrow, please God, we continue with another parable from Luke.